hey guys welcome and welcome back to another vlog in today's vlog we are taking a quick trip back to new well, new york city specifically the boogie down bronx so um right now i am packing my little weekend bag and yes as you can see i am an overpacker because you just never know it might rain it might get cold you might need to switch out your shoes because you did all that walking and now your feet hurt you know if you looked at my last new york vlog you know my aunt walks us to death like she walks us from 5 a.m to 12 midnight okay so you got to make sure you have the right shoes with her okay and you know how new york has that tricky weather you know one minute is like 80 something degrees and the next minute is 50 something degrees so you got to you know be prepared for the weather okay so right now i'm a pack i also got a bathing suit right there because we might go to the beach um so yeah so i'm about to pack real quick and i'm going to be using my new baboon to the moon um travel bag tote bag um and also i have the matching fanny pack so if you're not familiar with baboon to the moon um it is a nice little travel um a nice little travel leisure company that sells quality um tote bags and fanny packs matching matching travel essentials and they're waterproof great quality they're waterproof even the fanny pack is waterproof and i love waterproof travel essentials okay and fun fact about me i love anything travel any type of travel essential like backpacks totes luggage anything like that like i love it so i got it in this bright neon orange they have many colors to pick from and i got the size medium it comes in small medium and large and it has like i said many colors um this video is not sponsored however baboon to the moon i did a great video for you so you need to sponsor me sis sis where you at okay so let's get the packing okay so let's take this out the bag so the set this will run you about i think i paid like 160 for the set so, um, yeah, I think it's cheaper if you buy it in a set, the bag and the fanny pack. And look how spacious it is. Spacious. Dang, I can't talk, y'all. Spacious it is in this bag. And this is a medium size, like I said. It says the medium size, you could pack one to five days worth of clothes. See? All right. First, I'm going to put put my Nike sandals in here because I always got to have a backup pair of shoes, a backup pair of pants because, you know, you never know. All right, so my look for this weekend, this holiday weekend is comfort because when you out in New York and you doing all this walking, catching trains, buses, walking for like 12 hours straight, sis, you got to be comfortable. Not cute, but comfortable, okay? Forget being cute. So that's that. That's my bathing suit. So mainly I got shorts and I got one pair of pants, one pair of leggings rather. So mainly I have shorts and... Oh, where's my sneaker belt? And I'm bringing like one pair of sneakers just in case it rains. You know, I don't like my feet to be wet wearing sandals. So I'm bringing one pair of sneakers just in case it rains. Oh, look, look how much it packs already. And mind you, I just threw a whole bunch of crap in here. I didn't even like organize it or place it in here nice and neat. So yeah. So one pair of sneakers. My toiletry bag. Can't forget my do rag. Oh, y'all like my cut? Just got a cut yesterday. Nice little fade. As you can see, the blue is not coming out, y'all. It's been two weeks. And usually my color only lasts two weeks. Like that pink I had on my hair lasts two weeks. And I wash my hair every day because I don't want the color to last longer than two weeks. So I want to re dye it another color. But girl, this blue ain't coming out. Sis. So yeah, that's that. What else? Oh, my slippers. 
I hate walking around the house barefoot like that. I can't stand walking around the house, even my own house. I don't like, I don't like the way it feels on my foot. Mm -hmm. All right. So, get this together. And the reason why I really got this bag other than that is waterproof is because it comes with, let me show you. It comes with backpack straps. So you could put this on your back, like a backpack instead of carrying it like a satchel or like a regular, um, a regular tote bag. That's what I like. It's easier on your back. Ooh. Not heavy. It also has extra storage on the side. So it has this right here, this little pocket right here. Extra storage. And lift it up like that. Easy for when you're traveling on a plane, walking through the airport. I don't know if I'm gonna bring my fanny pack, this fanny pack on this trip, but I'm definitely gonna bring this fanny pack when I go to the DR in two weeks. So we're gonna leave that right there. And you know, I gotta bring me some glasses just in case my contacts decide that you want to be with the shit. Gotta bring my glasses along with me everywhere. I always gotta have a backup pair of glasses when I wear my contacts because if my contacts decide they wanna be with the shit, your girl cannot see. Gotta have my glasses. So that's that. Be right hey back. guys, we are in upstate New York and we are at a restaurant called Don Coqui and it says a taste of the Caribbean. Let me show you what it looks like. Don Koki, Taste of the Caribbean. So yes, I'm gonna show you the menu and the food. Would have kicked it. Oh man. Look at the birds. CJ talking about he, he would have kicked it because he would not have seen the birds sitting there. You hear the music, y'all? Hey, hey, hey. Come on, Sonny, dance. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> there go pops. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Reminds me of my sister. Document every. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you gonna get a? He was about to step over the bird. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Say hey to my vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Don Coquie. <laughs> it smells good. Oh, it do. How somebody gonna drink that? I think that's for a table. No, I'm saying how somebody. How do you? Oh. Put your cup with everybody. Put your glass under there. Oh. You don't put your mouth. Chips. They don't sell the chicken, the grilled chicken breast anymore, Rick? No, they change the menu. Uh, what you can do is uh, season salad with grilled chicken. Uh, season with grilled chicken is a size. I mean, salad is big and the chicken is good. That's yeah, for one person. For one person is good. Okay. Season with chicken is good. Yeah, that's what I want. What? What you want? The season salad with chicken grilled chicken. Yeah, yeah. good portion. Because it's solid big and a good portion of chicken. So it's just a chicken for you? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Let me try to use the dip for that, y'all. Just pour it. Just stick a chip in there. These chips are good. They come with some type of sauce. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
So we got some appetizers. So we got some coconut shrimp and some. Mm. So you have season with chicken, right? Yes. Chicken? Yes, sir. Thank you, man. Are you? I'm gonna get the oxtails. Okay. Now, you know Spanish oxtails is not the same as Jamaican. You know that, right? Oxtail, pernil, like a tomato bean sauce. Okay, forget the oxtails. I'm gonna get the pernil. Pernil? Yeah. Chop, chop, chicken, chop, chop. Uh huh. And it's not spicy. It's Spanish food. And it's red. It has like a, instead of like a how Jamaicans lay brown. Yeah. They are, what is the word they use for that? Um, they don't brown uh, the sauce. Uh-huh. It's a word they use for that to cook. They use a tomato base. Oh. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. This is cassava. It's three kinds of fruit there, I think. Yeah, cassava, plantain. Salt. Oh, I'm gonna let it go. Yeah, dip something in here and taste the salt. Mmm. Your guacamole is good. I'm gonna order another one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like coconut. Uh-uh. Oh, I love coconut. I like coconut ice cream. Yeah. No, I don't like coconut shrimp either, Rob. Uh, no, but you do like coconut, overdo it. though. I had a lot of bad ones where it was so much, I didn't taste the shrimp. It was, uh... Yeah, sometimes they had... They over sometimes yeah, they overdo it. Like, just like... Okay. But you do like coconut though, you just don't like coconut yeah, shrimp. Right, yeah. Oh, okay. oh yeah, I love coconut. What am I just saying? I, really I like just it. don't want it on my meat either. <laughs> I could eat uh, shredded coconut also uh, on the top of my drink or something like that. But Tony, you like coconut, you just don't like coconut? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Because it's sweet. She's serious as a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you don't like the sweetness? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I don't like the your sherry and chicken like that. Huh. Thank you. Nobody knew what he said. He was like, mm-hmm. I want to take this so you eat your food, oh. yeah? <laughs> hey, Vic. You said that sauce is mad good. It's like a sweet and spicy sauce. So we got our food now. I got the pini with uh, pigeon peas and rice, and it comes with potato salad. CJ got a Caesar salad. Sonny got the same thing I have, and my dad got what kind of salad you got? A chop house salad. A chop, a, a chop house salad. Chop house salad. No, oh, chop house salad. And this sauce right here, we found out is um a aioli sauce. It is so good, so good. Mmm, you want some? Open your mouth. Mmm. How's 
salad. Amazing. Yeah. 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 The dressing's in there. I know. This pani is so good. It's well seasoned. What you call mm. that again? Panil or pani. Hey guys, back again. Today is Sunday and we are touring New York again. So we are going on the Staten Island Ferry today. My dad just dropped us off over here instead of taking, you know, a thousand trains and buses to get over here from the Bronx. Staten Island Ferry. So Staten Island Ferry takes you by the um, Statue of Liberty and all the other um, nice touristy things that you want to see. a better view right here. Staten Island Ferry. Hey guys. <laughs> I'm too short to even, <laughs> you can't even see me. <laughs> With the crew. <laughs> Waiting on the um the ferry to come. It's so packed in here. So much packed. Oh. All the people come from that now. Just imagine trying to go to work. Oh, okay. Let me show you how the Statue of Liberty. You guys see it? Right there. Boop. Do y'all know the history of the Statue of Liberty? I bet you you don't. The Statue of Liberty was initially supposed to be a black woman from the French. And the United States rejected it. And this is her now. Look it up. The Statue of Liberty was supposed to signify the slaves that came over here from the French. And the United States was like, nah, we like being racist. So we'll, we don't want that. <laughs> Look it up. That's a fun fact for you today. We're moving. I should have bought my snacks. <laughs> your glasses secured on your face, Arthur? Oh. Sure, Frank thing. <laughs> God, look at Arthur. Look at Arthur. Ain't him so cute, Arthur. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Every day we're walking down the street and get along with each other. Hey. I say, hey. Oh, what a wonderful time of day. Hey. Oh, we can learn to love and play. Hey, and get, get along with it. <laughs> <laughs> so nice. Just 
got off the ferry and look where it dropped us off at. Right at Empire Outlet in Staten Island. Isn't that neat? It docks right at the outlet. It's got H&M, Old Navy. Look at this pigeon. Steady. DJ, give me this. I like this song. You know I love Caribbean music. Wind up, wind up, wind up. Wind up, wind up, wind up, wind up. Hey, hey, hey. Wind up, wind up, wind up, wind up. <laughs> this outlet lit. Uh-uh. He's walking like Jonia. walking like your <laughs> yep. Hey. Yep. 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 Ah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, having fun New York. exploring being tourists you know just have fun on a budget broken bougie's time okay <laughs> so guys so guess what there's no tax here in New York City on clothing that's a fun fact for you and also the ferry the Staten Island ferry guess what it was free bougie on a budget okay what you know about that? Look, Auntie, I bet I know what you gonna buy. What? Yeah, I know what you gonna buy some leggings. <laughs> Look, black. Just everything black. Black. <laughs> Oh look, this is on sale for $19, this Nike hoodie. I like this hoodie. An additional 30% off of that? Oh, and it's additional. Oh, okay. Let me walk around with this. I like this hoodie. I wish I had another color though. You don't like black? I've got so much black. Hey guys, so we stopped and got something to eat. It's right down the street from the outlet in Staten Island. What's this restaurant called? It's called Pier 76. Pier 76 Italian restaurant. <laughs> Look at Arthur again. Yo, what's up? Look at Uncy. <laughs> now I know how famous people feel. <laughs> So me and CJ order a pepperoni and sausage calzone and a cheesecake. And my aunt ordered spaghetti and meatballs. Cause she lame. Sorry, Em. Thank you. No problem. She too lame. <laughs> Want something I'm I'm glad she didn't get salad though, or any type of seafood because there's it's other things to eat. So many other things to eat. Oh, City Island. We might go there tonight. Every time we come to New York, like, we eat we so, much. so much. We eat so much. Oh we be goodness. having so much food. We be taking, like, groceries back home. And it was like, oh my God, just so much stuff. <laughs> so much stuff. <laughs> it's so cool being two and a half hours away versus. 15 hours away when we lived in Georgia. <laughs> now we could drive here every weekend if we wanted to. To harass my aunt. Thank you. Do you want me to say? Oh, you have oh, this here? Yeah, okay, thank you. <laughs> so we got our food. She is almost finished with her food. Mm -hmm. Make sure I'm getting it this time. Yep, she is almost finished with her food. And then we got our calzone. 
sausage and pepperoni. Mm. Ooh, it has ricotta cheese in it. I love cheese. You want some? You want a piece? Yeah, I'm gonna take it. Let me take a piece. Yeah. I'll get some for her. You probably get two more of those. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just take one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, BCB is fresh. I'll take one. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. well, come on, baby. Come on. Come mm -hmm. to mama. Mm -hmm. Come to mama. Look at the inside of the calzone. Nice and cheesy pepperoni and sausage. Ooh. You want some? Hey guys, it's Monday, Labor Day, and we are in the Spanish Deli. Okay, getting our bacon, egg, cheese, bacon, bacon, egg, cheese, bacon, egg, cheese. I am back today is Monday actually actual Labor Day um we are back on the road going back home to Maryland um you know we got to work tomorrow so we want to get an early start today so um we won't be too exhausted for the work week um and plus CJ he wants to work overtime today um so yeah we're back on the road so I'm gonna close out this video, but I wanna let you know, if you're traveling to New York from anywhere, make sure you bring your vaccination card. You have to be fully vaccinated to enjoy indoor dining and all the indoor attractions. So if you're not fully vaccinated, you won't be able to do any of those activities. So don't even waste your money if you're not fully vaccinated. And make sure if you are fully vaccinated and you are traveling to New York City, that you bring your vaccination card, okay? Hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Deuces. Well.